Hi guys, today I'm going to be doing another haul. I know I just put up a haul, but I did um, hit up Sephora again because I am, you know those, you know those VIB things and they had the whole 15% off. So I decided I wanted some stuff, so I might as well go pick it up now that I have 15% off. So I went on like a blush kick when I went. I picked up blushes like no tomorrow. The first one is by NARS. Um, this one is in Deep Throat. It's the beautiful peachy pink color. So I love this color. It's so beautiful on the cheeks. It's going to be perfect for spring. Love it. Um, next I picked up a Buxom one. And this one I wasn't really sure if I really wanted because it was really different from what I usually wear. But I did try it on in the store and my cousin Steph, Arco ed 0202 go check her out. I'll leave her link below. She just totally, she convinced me. She was like, it looks really good on your cheeks. So I ended up buying it and it's super bright. Like it's right here. It's like a reddish kind of purple. It is pretty intense, but so that's the second one I picked up. And this one was in Shangri Lala. I picked it up in The Confession. And this one is the kind of blushes I like to wear. It looks like this. It's so nice. I love this color. It's like a bronzy peach kind of color. And that looks like, it's this one swatch right here. The last blush I picked up was a Tarte one. And this one is the Amazonian clay one. And this one is an Exposed. And that looks just like this. And I have that swatched right here. This one is pretty similar to the NARS Deep Throat, except this one is matte. The, the Deep Throat is more of a satin shimmer finish, and the Amazonian is matte. And I actually picked up one eyeshadow from NARS. This one is in Lola Lola. It looks just like this. It's, it's a beautiful like reddish kind of brown. And I have that swatch right here. I put this all over my lid and it, it's like a beautiful, it's a beautiful finish. And then I just put in a darker color in my crease and it looks really nice. So that's all I picked up from Sephora. Um, then next I headed over to the drugstore and at Shoppers Drug Mart in Canada right now, um, we started carrying the essence line and I saw in this one girl's video that I watched her channel is Mopey G I believe and her link will be down below she made a haul and she was she had these products but I don't think I found the exact same one she she had the one she had was gorgeous but I don't think they had it just because everything was almost like all gone so I picked up what I could find and I picked up two blushes <laughs> the first one I got was in 30 um, secret it girl a beautiful peach orange so this is a color that's like really in for spring like those tangerine colors and it looks like this it's so beautiful this one I have swatched right here and then I picked up the next blush in 40 natural beauty and this is a lot more on the brown side. That I have swatched right here. From Essence, I also picked up a lip gloss. This one is in Nude Candy, number 19. And one thing I have to say about these lip glosses is they smell amazing if you wear this alone without something under it like right now i have on i had on airy fairy's um lipstick in well yeah airy fairy rimmel's lipstick in airy fairy and it look this gloss looks really nice over it but if you decide to wear this straight up on its own it's really nude so it will like erase your lips uh, so this is what it looks like right there so it's really nude and super pigmented well, at walmart i got an aussie hair insurance product 
And this is the leave-in conditioner, uh, protects not so healthy hair against style disasters. This is one of the best smelling things that I have. Um, Aussie always has really good smelling products and this, when you put it in your hair, you can still smell it. Like, I don't think it'll, it'll last the whole day, but it just leaves your hair smelling so clean and fresh and fruity and it smells like coconuts or banana or something like that, but it smells like a lot like coconuts. I also picked up two uh, brushes. Um, these are from Equal Tools. I picked up the Equal Tools Bamboo Blush Brush and it looks just like this. Um, I don't have a blush brush actually. The only blush brush I have is this um, angled one. This is supposed to be, I think, for... In this is an angled contour blush, but I do love it for blush, but I wanted to try on like... I needed another blush brush because all I have is one. So I did pick up this one. This one was, I think, $9, 8 or $9. And that'll be good for blush. Uh, then I picked up the really popular one, Equal Tools Bamboo Bronzer Brush. And it looks just like this. And I don't think I'll be using this for bronzer very much but I do want to use this for powder so it's really dense super compact so I think this will be really nice to put on a powder you know just pat it into your skin pat in the powder and it's still fluffy enough to like blend it out I think that's all that I have to say oh my god and the MAC collection just came out and I've been watching some videos on it especially what's uh um this girl called Gabriella. Her YouTube channel is Makeup by Gabriella. I'll put her link down below as well. She's so amazing. Like she has some of the best videos. Um, she always shows like when she does like a haul, she goes through her products and it's so nice. She goes through all her blushes and her lipsticks and a lot of the time she's wearing the product. So I think that's what I really love. Like I love to see if somebody's talking about a product, I like to see them actually wearing it so I can know what it looks like. So yeah, I checked out her video on her recent like MAC um, haul and oh my god, the MAC stuff looks so amazing. The blushes are beautiful. She had this eyeliner that was like a silvery lilac oh my god i'm so jelly i really do need to pick that up um the lipstick oh my god she was wearing one of the lipsticks i think that's about it this video is really long so i'll let you guys go and leave any questions or comments below and i'll get back to you guys oh and don't forget to check out my my contest video which is almost finished i think about another two weeks and then i'll be announcing my winners so stay tuned for that and go enter and that's about it so bye guys